Supa28 says, we are using 20 Unify AP Pro 7s in a large community space. We have issues moving between access points. So the first thing that I would do, again, I have no information other than what you've typed, but 20 Unify uh, uh, UAP Pro 7s or U7 Pros, I think is the actual model number, depending on how large your community space is, that might be too many access points. Have you put that into the Unified Design Center and put all the access points on the map and see how much coverage is overlapping? Because oftentimes we'll see that people put in too many access points and actually removing some of those access points is better for the network so that you're not confusing devices. Because remember, devices like your smartphones here, the device is choosing which access point to connect to. It's not the access point saying, hey, you iPhone connect over here, all right? It's the iPhone deciding which one is best. So what you need to do as the wireless administrator for that community space is you need to make it such that the iPhone's decision on which access point to connect to is easier if that makes sense. And sometimes that means tuning down the power of some access points, and sometimes it means not having too many access points for a device to choose from. Basically, when you're walking around a big open space, there should be like one access point that's like the obvious choice for a device to connect to. And then as you get further and further away from it, a different device should become the obvious one. And if you've got four or five competing for which is the obvious choice, you're gonna have roaming problems. And so that's kind of what I would say there. Uh, let's see, we got minimum DBM set. Again, so minimum DBM is, is fine, but I would say crank those, if you're in a big open area, crank those access points, but have fewer of them, right? Let them, let them blast out their signal, but have fewer access points. Like, think of access points as, uh, think of it as, as if it were a light bulb, right? And the light bulb is just shining out from the access point. Uh, you know, typically omnidirectional. You don't want too many light bulbs lighting up that space. You want one light bulb lighting up an area, and then another light bulb lighting up a different area. Right? So kind of think of it like that. 